Thanks very much, Tom. More than half of the students in Central Florida can't afford lunch, let alone school supplies. But today, a gift for teaching kicked off its campaign to give kids the stuff they need to succeed. Local 6 Morning Anchor Matt Austin was there for the special event. When students in Florida schools have a need, their teachers often try to fulfill it, but... It's a big problem. We have a lot of kids who have a lot of needs. Matt Rebolts works at Walker Middle School, and today he's speaking at a gift for teaching about the impact he can have with the right tools. It lets me develop those relationships. If I take care of those immediate needs with the children, they let me know about other things going on with their families, with their friends, within the community, and it just serves as a, um, just a bridge to all kinds of other non-academic issues. Today, the Enzian Theater was a buzz as prospective fundraisers gather a plan to help out. In many cases, devoted teachers can spend between five Five hundred and a thousand dollars out of their own pockets to provide for kids. The issue of need in this community is, is is off the scale. I think everybody understands that public schools are really struggling. Budget cuts are just rampant, and there are so many families who can't provide for their children. A gift for teaching hopes to raise one hundred and thirty-five thousand dollars during this campaign to provide for kids while helping their teachers. That was Matt Austin reporting, and you can learn more about a gift for teaching by visiting clickorlando.com. Click on the Scene on Six section on our homepage, then look under Friday's Stories.